nothing can break me. I say nothing. If you go here for Instagram, I go come YouTube. If you go from YouTube, I'll go Twitter. If you go from Twitter, I'll go Snapchat. If you go from I will go TikTok. Some might say it's too early for the year, but the social media beef between Bob Risky and his adopted son, James Brown, has taken a new turn. The two most popular controversial cross dressers in Nigeria are fighting over success, cross dressing, and who is doing it better. Without a doubt, James Brown has been doing great for himself since he got popular in 2018, grabbing promotion deals here and there, including those that go against Instagram community guidelines without giving an F. But Brisky, on the other hand, has become more classy and selective of what he does and posts on social media. However, despite being a generous giver, as Bob Brisky began to see James Brown as a threat in his world, could this be why he asked him to stop copying his style, which began World War 2021? Hello guys, it's T-Code here for African Gleeds. I used to like Bob Brisky. I used to really, really bomb for him because she, 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 she reached out to people and everything. But he, I don't know what he's, he's doing right now. I don't know what is it. I don't ask him. Obi Alor James, popularly known as James Brown, became famous in August 2018 after being arrested alongside 56 others suspected of indecent behavior in a nightclub where James Brown stated that he was HIV positive. Although he has recently recanted the HIV story and claimed he only has it so he would be freed. However, he began to gain fame over the statement, they didn't cut me, which encouraged him to become an influencer. His viral attitude inspired Bob Brisky, who was already a queen in the game. He met and gifted James Brown 100,000 Naira with a promise of 200,000 Naira monthly to look after his health and self. Bob Brisky also began coaching and teaching him the business of cross-dressing and how to make it in the industry. But it looks like James Brown, who was getting a lot of attention, knew exactly how he wanted to do things and run his own empire. But you reach out to me and you dash me money, which is good. But if you feel like that, why you come to beg for money? So, you can just insult me. I never enter your DM to bear for the money. You give me money out of your willingness. In late January 2020, the relationship began to go sour. James Brown shockingly called out Bob Brisky on social media, claiming that he blocked him on Instagram. Though he didn't reveal if they had secrets before getting blocked by Nigeria's male Bobby, James Brown expressed shock over Bob Brisky's action. When we thought the two most popular cross-dressers in Nigeria would eventually get along this time, the weather changed for the worst. On Friday, January 15, James Brown called Bob Bob Brisky out on social media stating that Bob Brisky with over 3 million followers on Instagram sent him a direct message asking him to stop copying his content. He also said that Bob Brisky threatened to kill him. Bob Brisky reached out to me. I thought he wanted to greet me, hurt me. Bob Brisky threatened me that I should leave whatever I'm doing. Or any content on my page that I should leave it that I'm copying his content. Please, I want to ask you guys, am I copying Bob Brisky content? If he, he even threatened to kill me. Oh no, my baby, me, oh my dick, the lumini. I'm serious, I was shocked. In his reaction, James Brown said he isn't surprised at Bob Brisky's action because he knows some seniors never want to see their juniors shine. Hours later, Bob Brisky responded, threatening to arrest James for the call-out video. Bob Brisky via his Instagram page in a now-deleted post threatened to send a tiny rat to sell. James fired back, stating that he isn't afraid to go to jail as he has been there before. He wrote, When you respect people, they take you for granted and disrespect you. And now they use your words against you. This life, eh? Fear people. Sell is not a new thing. I have been there before and I left. Most influential people go to sell. If the country can't take me to sell due to freedom of expression, no one will. Only God can. And even God won't threaten us with prison. I am unbreakable. The 22-year-old went on to say that he cross dresses just for fun only on Instagram but dresses as a man while going out so Uncle Bob shouldn't see him as a threat. Those people are getting it all wrong. I am not a cross dresser. Read my lip. I will never drag with Bob Risky. No, I'm interested. I'm a comedian, pure comedian. Okowa Labemi, I have it and I'm using it back to back. Few hours after James responded to Bob Brisky's threat, his Instagram page of over 180,000 followers got deactivated, which prompted the IG user to point accusing fingers at Bob Brisky. They accused him of reporting James' page until it was deactivated. Bob Brisky has since responded to the allegation and has denied having anything to do with James' page being deleted. He also expressed his love for James Brown and says, Mama still love him. But the truth is that James Brown's Instagram account was taken down because several of his posts 
post go against Instagram community guidelines. He received a message from Instagram with evidence of a few of his posts that goes against the social media platform guidelines and he was told his account might be deleted because of it. If you follow James Brown, you will know he does the most on Instagram from posting adult adverts to talking and showing nudity. It's a shame that Instagram remembered him just in time during his big beef with Bob Brisky and it looks like Bob Brisky is the one behind his deleted page. James Brown angrily went to his YouTube channel to drop this video. It coming like last year or like I should stop wearing a week. Stop wearing a phone. Stop doing this, stop doing that. I beg, Joma be no, I don't feel bad. Bob Risky, on the other hand, was very upset for being accused of reporting James Brown's page. Some also said that he did the same to Tunde Ednot after calling him in a rant early this January. Pray nobody will accuse of what you don't know this year. The prayer is deep. People will just sit down and accuse you wrongly. Please have a little of conscience sometimes. Ever since I've joined IG, I've never reported anybody page before. Those of you accusing me, continue. Very soon, they will accuse you of what you know nothing about. But does James Brown believe Bob Brisky has nothing to do with his account being deleted like Tunde Ednot? We guess this beef will continue and any hope of these two becoming friends again will never happen. But never say never, right? I'm not put, I don't have breath. I'm not going to do surgery. I have what God has given me. I have poro, poro, and I'm going to be using it back to back. So why are you feeling threatening? And Do you think Bob Brisky is jealous of James Brown's success? And why he asked him to stop copying him as a cross-dresser? Do you think James Brown's page was taken down due to his action? Or would you say he got the Bob Brisky effect? Let us know what you think in the comment section down below. If you found this video entertaining, please give it a like and share. Don't forget to check out our channel for more interesting African stories and news we know you'll like. Subscribe to get notifications whenever we drop a new juicy video to keep you updated. Thanks for watching and see you on our next one.